Hey, good morning. This is Steve Baumgartner. Thanks for coming back. Appreciate it. It's been a while. Uh, this uh, one's not going to really cover any of my normal subjects. I'm just going to kind of shoot the breeze on something that happened. So hang loose. Be right back. So, life-changing situation. Xbox died. No! I mean, it's like I fish out of water. What do I do? Uh, I can't use the normal TV thing because it doesn't get all the little uh, things I have, uh, applications. It's like I've been using that since 2000-something, uh, early. And uh, it's kind of like a, a third appendage. <laughs> so... Uh, I play a game called uh, Destiny, and uh, a friend of mine from work, uh, AT&T, back when it was Southwestern Bell. So with two of us, we kind of play. He's got uh, some health issues. I got Aww. health issues, so kind of comes into play for us to uh, sit there and do this for a few hours and kind of clear our minds and get some rest in. So this sucker went out. It started flickering. The screen just kind of went going in black and uh, I thought oh man it's got to be the TV so I'm sitting there and I'm downloading stuff resetting the TV uh, doing all the settings nothing so I thought you know what why don't I do like I was taught at work started doing some diagnosis some testing in some different environments so if I unhook the uh, Xbox and run the TV all day without anything attached to it work perfectly so TVs mostly out of the equation. It could be the connection on the TV. So, tested it with a different TV. Had a little mobile TV, hooked it up, boom, same thing. So, now we know this is the Xbox. It looks like the uh, video card is going out. This is the important part. When you buy one of these units, make sure you register it with Microsoft or Sony, whoever you use. Now Google. Um, anyway, Register it, you get a warranty. Luckily, I had until 15th of February 2020, full warranty. So, this sucker, you can see it in the, the back over here, all boxed up. It's going back today. It'd probably take a month for it to go through and come back. But, uh, you know, that's my uh, Xbox One X, uh, one terabyte. Uh, I use an external drive, so that's kind of cool. And get more on there, even though I don't do much. <laughs> I don't really play one game. And that's Destiny. Uh, most of the stuff I just do streaming, you know, for Netflix and things like that. So watch a lot of movies. And I tell you, the reason I do that is I hate commercials. I hate commercials. I passionately hate commercials. Goes into a commercial. I have no idea what I was watching prior. I kind of like doing the binge thing where you can go from one to the next to the next also it goes from it kind of blacks out it kind of because they kind of program before a commercial but it goes black and eh, right back into the program again so no commercials I, I love that I hate doing you know, seeing stuff I just don't care about so that's my uh, devastating thing that happened to me Xbox down again luckily I do try to keep the current version, or I did. I don't know if I can do that anymore. But in the past, I kept upgrading to the next version of the Xbox. So I had the 360, Xbox One, Xbox One S, and now the Xbox One X. Um, you know, they're coming, coming out with the new one, the square tower looking one. That's probably going to be a little too expensive for me, but uh, I think this one will last me for quite some time. So, but anyway, make sure you have a backup. That way you don't miss out on any of this stuff. So, that's it. Just wanted to share that bit with you. Talk to you next time.